Oh, that's me. That's my footsteps. Oh my god! Fears to Fathom, Episode 4. Iron Bar Lookout. May 12th. Here we are, finally, in our RV on the open road with the bars. Rayel, is that you, bro? Is that you? <laughs> we are, we're actually controlling this, by the way. We are actually controlling this. Kayla Nelson. So Kayla sent us a text message. How is it looking? Still on my way. Van decided to pull a flat tire on me today out of all days. Isn't it late? If I don't starve to death before arriving, I'll be fine. Did you pass Roseburg yet? No? Why? Uh-uh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. First of all, texting and driving is a sin. It's a mortal sin, okay? Actually, I shouldn't be doing that. Don't do that. I don't care how open the world is. Do not text and drive, bro. I've made that mistake already. I lived a very solitary life. That's the, I think that's the best type of life to live, to be honest, or away from people. It helps quiet my mind, keep the memories at bay. Yes, yes, serene, serenity. I like that. Oh God, wait, hold on, bro. This turn kind of, hey, hey, this turn kind of tricky. <laughs> oh, what is, Rayo, that's you singing too? <laughs> hey, chill out. I've always loved the great outdoors. Just being surrounded by nature gave me happiness. I feel like I was at home in the woods. I am not, I am not like a countryside woods type of person, bro. I'm not, I'm just like, put me in the city, put me next to like a bunch of restaurants and I'm good, bro. Like all I need is like a, a, a McDonald's and a, y'all Y'all probably don't even know what Zaxby's is. I heard that Zaxby's is not, not across the country like I thought it was, it's not, <laughs> it's not. I heard the West Coast don't even have it like that, bro. I remember there's this uh, dinner diner while passing Rosenberg. These are hard to read. Jesus, they have the best burgers in town. Okay, so she wants us to stop by. She wants us to stop by uh, a little diner. Is this the diner right here? This is not the diner. I'm about to crash. Oh, this is just a gas station. I saw the diner Kayla was talking about. Oh, this is the diner. This is the diner. Hey, hey, I heard there was food in here. Hey. <laughs> I heard y'all have food. Where's the toast? All right, let's exit out our refined vehicle so we can enter into this eating establishment. Where's the door? Look how, whoa, man, we look like such a dick parking like this. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, wait, there's a, a nice young gentleman, a nice strapping looking gentleman. Hey, how's that burger? This little piece of heaven, this place is pretty much my weekend spot. Okay, weird looking face. You new around here? Uh, I'm a new staffer at Iron Bark State Park. You must have heard the news then. What news? Well, a few weeks ago, three kids went missing in the park. It's been all over the news. What happened to them? No one knows. <laughs> I think you took them. The official report says they got lost, but a lot of people around here think something else happened. Something else? There's a rumor going around that a creature got them. A creature? Yeah, you know, like Bigfoot or a goat man. People say there's something like that living in that forest. Or a man with a cheeseburger in his hand. I don't know. Do you believe it? A lot of hikers and campers go missing in that forest. Some of them come back with stories you would not believe. Oh, man. Some of them never come back. Oh, oh my God. We got an achievement for talking to this guy. <laughs> oh, okay, well, uh, you enjoy your burger. I'm going to go... Um, I'm gonna go find the entrance, young man. All right, let me just calm my nerves. I don't want to embarrass myself when I get in here. <clears throat> okay. Everybody listen up. Put your titties in the bag. Put them Put in. Put it in. <laughs> uh, could you imagine, though? Welcome to Twin River Diner. How are you doing today? Um, good. How about you? I, I, should, I should be nice. Good. How about you? Feel free to take any seat you like, and I'll be right with you. All right, thank you. Bro, y'all have no idea how much waitress jobs suck. They, they're awful. They don't get paid any like, and their pays, their pay comes from tips, bro. Their pay comes from tips, and you know how tips go. Some people get that, some people get great tips, some people don't. Good evening, I'm Barbara. Are you ready to order? Yes, so what can I get for you today? Uh, meatball sub with chicken nuggets, grilled cheese sandwich with, um, cheeseburger with fries. He's working with fries. I just think, I, I feel like that's not being too greedy. You know what I'm saying? Our burger is the best in the West. Would you like anything to drink? Ooh, I don't prefer Coke. I hate coffee. We can be a kid. Strawberry sulsh. Okay. <laughs> Strawberry sulsh. Strawberry slush, I think I meant to say. Perfect anything else. Um, 
that'll be all thank you I, I think i think we should be nice yeah we should be nice i don't know i guess it's like a personal bias bro great i'll bring the food out as soon as it's done just let me know if you need anything else we'll do actually no let's <laughs> let's let's do sounds good uh appreciate it this one yeah um yeah waitress job suck i've always had this habit of peeing before eating peeing before eating am i about to pee myself am <laughs> wait am i about to go right here no way ain't no way rayel was like hey <laughs> y'all like the pee and scene so much but there's a bathroom right there i should be able to just get up right i really had to pee but i'm trying oh okay you gotta press space to get up all right let's go all right let's let's <laughs> let's, let's shoot our rocket off yeah yeah all over the place all over the place in this fine eating establishment yes Take it on the walls. I spilled. You dang right I spilled. <laughs> you dang right I spilled. All right. Now that I've marked my territory. Wait, can I actually wash my hands? I can. I can. Always wash your hands before you eat, bro. Always wash your hands before you eat. Like, on a, on a serious note, y'all have no idea how many germs just be spreading. Close that up. Let's go take our seat. Where were we sitting? Were we? Yeah, we were sitting here. Barbara. Where are you at, Barb? Me and me and Barbara, we on first name basis already. You know. Not to not to not to brag or anything, but me and Barbara, we got it like that. Me and Barbara, we we like this, bro. Thank you, Bar oh. Okay, bye Barbara. Uh, thank you for the food, I guess. I don't know. She don't want to talk to me right now. She's upset about what I just said. We got our condiments. We got mustard, ketchup, mayonnaise. That burger. Uh, we can't put the. We can't put the, 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 the. You know, let's just start with the fries. I, I, I start with the sides anyway. I don't know. I don't know why I do that, but I like to start with sides before I do the main course or the main main food. I figured it'd be a while before I had a meal like this. Okay, he's right. Oh God, we're just eating this dry cheeseburger with no condiments on it. Kayla Nelson. Let me see what Kayla's talking about. I could really use a good meal before starting. Uh, thanks, Kay. So did you end up going? How was it? It was great, Kay. It was great. I'm having a great time, Kay. I'm having a great time. That was really weird. Why did you do that? Why did she do that, bro? <laughs> All right, let me eat. You know who she kind of reminds me of? She kind of looks like that woman from, uh, was it Insidious? Where she's like, don't you dare! <laughs> it, or was it The Conjuring 2? It might have been The Conjuring 2. I can't remember. <laughs> but she looks like. Wow, yes. Oh, wait. Dang, I was trying to read my messages. Did you enjoy the food? Yes. Would you like to have anything else or should I get the check? Check, please. Okay, I'll be right back. Thanks. That was. I don't like the way she just walked up on me like that. This food reminds me. You should send me that uh, casserole recipe you were talking about. I might get a chance to immerse myself in the art of cuisine in a new lookout. Wow. Yes. I'm on my way home. In, uh, did I send you in a bit? Is, I think, I'm pretty sure this has sent you in a bit. I cannot read today. Here's a check. Your total is seven dollars and sixty cents. Leave a tip. Let's leave a tip. You are outside of your mind if you think I'm about to leave a fifty percent tip. You, you are not Postmates. Hope you enjoy the rest of your ride. Thanks. Have y'all noticed, bro? Postmates and, and, and DoorDash? They kind of crazy. <laughs> I mean, you could just not tip, right? But the, the, literally, the full tip goes to the delivery driver. Whereas the rest of that, that the burger is like $3. You paying like $12 for that $3 burger, right? And then there's a tip on top of that. <laughs> Terrible. Let me get in my... My RV, my state of the art RV. Okay, uh. Oh, we gotta start the car first. Okay. Alright, let's go. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, look, both look, look down the street to make sure I'm not crashing into anybody. Alright, let's go. All jokes aside, bro, on, on a serious note, I've been waiting for this for so long. I just, I really, really love these, um, Here's the Fathom games. 8.02 p.m. 
Oh, we in the mood. Listen, listen to the songs we got playing. I wonder. Why is everything getting all eerie? I want to include the look this location of this park. I want to include the location of the park. But I don't want anyone seeking out the utter horrors I've seen in these woods. Okay, so this is this is basically him telling us about um so this is a continue way. Oh <laughs> I should have taken it easy. You're right, I should have taken it easy. I don't know why I turned in that hard. <laughs> Or I didn't turn in hard enough. There we go. But uh, yeah, I feel like that's a continuation of him uh, telling the story. So he's in his mind right now, right? He's basically saying that he doesn't want anybody else to know about this. So no one else plays this game and goes sees it. He tries to go visit it. I, I would be lying if I, I would absolutely be lying if I didn't say I'm, I'm a little bit interested in the actual location, right? All right, can we go through here? Do not block. Oh. Oh wait, were we supposed to bring our RV through here? And oh, we walked in. <laughs> what the freak, man? Holy moly, you scared me. I thought you were one of them. You scared me. May Lord have mercy. I hate you with everything in me. Anyways, can I see your permit, please? Oh, I'm not a camper. You're Billy, right? Let's do that one. Kind of, you know, the new transferred fire lookout. Kind of put him on his toes. That correct? I didn't know we were hiring this season. Hang on, let me check on that. I feel like he's got a, he's got like an Alabama type of accent, right? Maybe. Maybe? No, 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 no. I take that back. Maybe he's got like a... Not Alabama. Alabama. Man, come on. You got to stop doing that. Okay, pal. You're going to go. You're stabbed at, at fire. <laughs> I apologize for the confusion. I was under the impression that the tower would be left on staff for the season, but here are your keys. Yeah, you're, you're. Let me open the trail gate for you. All right, I appreciate it. I'm going to go bring my RV around, all right? Make sure you lower both or open both sides up. I don't want to scratch nothing. Wait, is he coming to me? Hey, he's coming to me. Why are you coming to me? Hello? Oh. Since you're arriving this late, you might also need this flashlight for the long hike to your lookout. So I can't drive the RV. I actually do have to walk. Ah, thank you, Billy. I appreciate it, Bills. You be careful. Take this. Kind of suspicious. Welcome to Iron Bark, pal. I don't like the way you said that. Now for our purposes, when you get to your tower, be sure to make your first weather report from your system just so we know you've clocked in. Okay. If need be, you can reach out to Tower 12 during your staffing. Nice enough, guy. He'll be your closest contact in case of any emergency. Um, thank you, Billy. All right, uh. Hey, just a piece of advice. Don't travel any further than half a mile or so north of your tower. Why? No, 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 that's 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 that's, that's why. Dangerous woods that way, pal. Bobcats and bears. Nasty business. You got it. You freaking weirdo. I thought he was trying to scare me, but he looked dead serious. Yeah, he he <laughs> his facial expression never changed. I left my bag in the RV at first. Oh God, is that telling me to turn around? Can I please just keep going? I'm just up. I guess I'll go get that bag. All right, now that we have our bag, 11.32 PM, the real hike begins. It was a long hike and it was starting to get cold now. All right, let's, uh, tower 11. Yep, that's us. Go this way. Nice little, nice little, uh, river. Got a tower over there. Is this our tower? Wait a second. Is this? Please don't tell me this is Tower Eleven. This is. There's no walls. Look at. Why am I so fast right here? <laughs> God, I was so fast just now. Okay, this must not be our tower. Okay, no, this is not our tower. This is like a radio. Uh, yeah, a radio station, maybe. Station, tower. You know what I'm talking about. I try to act like y'all know what I'm talking about, bro. It's been a long day. You know, you have long days. Tower 11 is to the left and Lacey Trail is to the right. Okay, 
Uh, all right, let's go to our tower. Let's not go that way. Living in a fire tower is not a glamorous job. Imagine being out here alone for weeks at a time. It's not for everyone. Go up here. But I've always had a fondness for the outdoors. I ascended the stairs to the top of the tower. Yes, we're ascending very fast. Once you're on top of the tower, your job is to look for fires or anything out of the ordinary. Yeah, this is, gives me heavy, heavy. I, I forget. I wish I could remember what it's called. I think it was called Fire Tower. I don't remember. The cabin was filled with the aroma of wood, giving me a sense of comfort. I was finally in my new home for the next few months. We can open this. Okay, so... Oh man, there's a there's a lot in here. There's a lot to unpack. We have a a, a radio transmitter. Uh, let's sit down. Let's see, radio equipment was sitting on a wooden table. Can I press it? I can't press it yet. Forgot to turn the generator on at first. Ah, makes sense. Makes makes perfect sense. So we need to turn on the generator. Um, can I pick this? I can. Okay, let's head downstairs, bro. It only makes sense that the generators it's somewhere down here oh i see a little cabin over there but let's see oh we have a port we have our own porta potty and there is the generator i just know that this job's gonna be the most unsettling job in the world and the, now that the generator's on oh look the lights are on the lights are on at the cabin is there oh that's just a light it was shining so brightly i thought it was like something to pick up it was not it was not that <laughs> um my hands were full drop this then the compass. Okay, well, what else is here? Is this all there is to it? Okay, well, uh, that was interesting, I suppose. Well, I mean, it's good to know that that was there, right? So we have a compass just in, in case we get lost. Or, or maybe, you know, I, I'd imagine we have buddies. They probably might be like, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm at the North Tower, right? And then, we, oh, look, look, look. Yeah, there's a tower over there. The lights are on. Okay, can we turn? We can finally turn the lights. Okay, I don't need this light anymore. Let's put this away. Let's sit down at the computer. Or actually... Yeah. Yeah, let's... Let's do that first. Alright. Ironbark Fire Department. Uh, turn this on. Nobody? Okay. Can we turn the computer on? Oh! rainbow oh look how old <laughs> this system looks ancient yeah this this has got to be taking place like in the 60s maybe 70s 60s the 80s 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 or 90s there we go that's more like it. hit the iron bar rules higher okay so we need to in order to get the password we need to check the rules oh look out must follow these rules while, oh yep yeah, this is it all right lights out after 12 p.m wait a second Okay, I thought I heard somebody behind me, bro. <laughs> All right. Um. Oh, so the system password is just Iron Bark with uh the number of tower I'm in. So just Iron Bark eleven, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, any more any more importance within the rules? There are no more importance. No video games. Okay, I'm gonna play video games. So just like you know, I I will be playing games. I will be playing games. Iron Bark. Yes, we're in. Okay. Um. Oh man, it's. Oh, there is Smiley, your trusty virtual assistant, here to help you make the most of your computer today. Hello, Smiley. Oh, what's on your mind today? A lot. I don't. I don't think you want to know, Smiley. I. I don't think you want to know. <laughs> um. Hmm. Let's let's do employee training. Oh, we got to double click. Welcome to Ironbark State Park. That is Jack Septic. If you're watching <laughs> this video, then let me be the first to say <laughs> that is that is Jack. Yeah, his voice is just so noticeable. By the Ironbark Fire Department to protect one of the most prestigious parks in the state of Washington. Established in 1897, we've been known as one of the safest parks in America. We hope you can keep it that way for many years to come. Oh, I, w I won't. I'm gonna burn it this down. This training video will ensure that you work to the best of your abilities. 
You've been selected as one of our fire lookout observers. This is a truly rewarding job which requires many hours of hard work. You will be working in our state-of-the-art lookout towers. And the following is a list of responsibilities you will have. Keep watch for fire. Huh? Fire isn't going to be noticeable all of the time. So also keep watch for smoke. Make sure to know what color the smoke is. It may be crucial information. Fires are best stopped before they spread out of hand. Yeah, I heard that. Keep I heard that actually is true. When the temperature rises, look at the color. that we have those recorded. The science nerds at the Panoramic Preservation Society require us to note all changes in temperature. We think it's best not to get into a lawsuit. <laughs> Keep records of daily wind speed. Wind is a big factor when it comes to fire. Absolutely. Use the anemometer to scientifically gather the data. Anemometer. After collecting the data, input it into our state-of-the-art service reporting form. This is a highly complicated form, often used by NASA employees. So don't be too ashamed if you can't figure it out at first. You have the privilege of using such Not a Not everyone form. will get on the first try. Keep campers out of unregistered campgrounds. The campers might start a campfire which could lead to a wildfire. They will not always listen to authority, so take precaution when escorting them. Okay. Make sure to know whether the person is a threat. If you're worried about your safety, do not hesitate to I'm dial hit him with Okay, call 911. All right. No, I'm throwing hands, bro. Keep I'm throwing hands. The park. Make sure the park is kept clean. We have a status to uphold. Now that you know most of the duties that a fire lookout has, you're ready to start. Uh, mostly. <laughs> we hope that you have a great season out there on the tower. Try not to damage any of the equipment. And remember, if you see smoke, don't joke. <laughs> Call the authorities and notify them of the predicament immediately. <laughs> oh, dear God. Ranger Dan. Thank you, Ranger Septicai. Dan Septicai. <laughs> Dan <laughs> That actually even sounds good. I'm glad. I'm glad to see Jack is actually doing roles, like doing act, uh, voice acting roles. I'm happy for Jack's up guy. What's this? I mean, we can watch this. Yeah, why not? And we are back. So how do you feel about being a plant? Do you most rise? Fascinating. <laughs> what do you do for a living? <laughs> it plants. Uh -huh. it, it it does plant things. That work. Is it explaining photosynthesis? Wow. What do you mean? Everyone's been wondering, how's the marriage with the wife? Gee, ho! <laughs> what if he said that? Sir, sir, there's no need for that language. <laughs> he did say that. Sir, calm down. He's calling his wife a slut. What did you just say? <laughs> Nobody talks to me like that on my show. What the f did you just say? Oh! Get over here, you piece of sh. <laughs> <gasps> hey, we might have to we might have to pull that show up on the tube. Ron Ross? Oh, can I move this a little bit? No? Okay. Alright, no, that's fine. Let's look at Ron Ross. Well, I'm sorry, what? My wife. I love my wife. Anyways, a little water there. Testicular green. To, to switch brushes. Oops, that's the wrong brush. That's my needle. Oh, your what needle? Later. Ah, there it is. The basting brush. This brush is really great for painting in those details. I think I'll put a little tree here. Those are the wrinkles of the ball sack. Whoa. You know what would look good here? A nice happy cabin right there. <laughs> Reminds me of when I had an affair with my wife with a squirrel. Enough with the what? With the whole sweet some fan mail. Sent in by you guys. Yeah, let's do that. Eviction notice. Let's not do that. <laughs> uh, forget the fan mail. We'll be right back after this. <laughs> Yo, Ron's got it, got it tough, don't he? Jesus! 
testicular green bro <laughs> every every name of mine from now on is going to be testicular green bro i might even change my youtube name to that testicular green I feel like I'm having a fever dream. I feel like, <laughs> you know how you have dreams and they just don't make sense and they just like kind of put there. Oddly enough though, it does, it does kind of make sense. You know what, I'm wrong. This dream makes sense, it makes perfect sense. You no know, cat just going through his daily life and then the owners just having a cat i guess uh, i don't know cats are weird bro don't don't own a cat that's 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 what i took away from this cats are weird don't own the on the cat they just be doing weird stuff just be up on the top of your refrigerator doing that that leg stretch thing and licking it why don't we just go ahead and start entering out this report a date and time's already welcome to the state of the art service recording software develop hello uh, New guy. I haven't gotten your name yet. What is it again? Who is this? I'm Connor. Fire Tower 12. I saw your light turn on. Thought I was going to be alone out here. Right? Isn't that the job? No. We've had to cover your area until you arrived. Yeah, I want to be kind of aloof. aloof. Anyways, what brings you to this towering paradise of ours? Just looking for a change. I'm really just looking for a change. I'm a transfer from Iron Horse. I can see why Mitch picked you. I'm really tired. You got a fire going? No. Get her lit. The temperature is about to plummet. You don't want to sit through the storm shivering. Got it. Thanks. All right, so we gotta we gotta light the fire. Um, I did want to do this first. You know what? Let's 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 go ahead and light the fire. Let's 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 go ahead and light the fire because if I if I procrastinate, I might freeze to death. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know the entails of this. This might be very intricate. I'm missing something, huh? <laughs> I guess I'm missing something. Oh, I can't go? Okay. It seems I can't go. I guess we won't be lighting that fire yet. I guess we won't be like maybe they want me to do something else before we light the fire so let's figure that out first we can try throwing another there was no oh Wood stove should be around the entrance. Get her lit. i'm trying I, I found it i found that out already but i can't do anything with it uh connor wait why is that beeping all right let's can i click back on it oh i can okay now i have the option Marley? The staffer who was in the lookout before you. Okay. She was one gritty woman. Anyways, you better get that fire going. You don't want to sit through the storm. Gasoline must be in your cabin, but if not, you can always grab your supplies from the storage shack. Oh, we passed the storage shack earlier. Okay, I know where that is. But it won't let us go down there, right? I think it stops us before we can actually go down. Oh! Okay, so we had to wait until he... Okay, all right, all right. No, that makes sense. Okay. Let's go into the storage shack. I don't see anything happening. I gotta make sure I gotta always, always watch behind you, bro. You never know. All right, we got gasoline. Well, that clearly cannot go in there again. Actually, let's set that down because wouldn't we need wood? Yeah, because he said wood first. Let me pick this up. Ah, there we go. Okay. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and drop the wood into the, uh, into the little fireplace thing. Ah, very intricate. I like this. I don't, I don't, I just don't think I could ever, ever do this <laughs> in reality, bro. I, I don't think I could. 
needed to light light it up burn burn fire oh needed gasoline okay oh god i gotta go back downstairs to get the gasoline jesus wait didn't i have wait no 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 no. didn't i have gasoline already in in my thing didn't i bring some up here already did i bring some did, did i make that up all right looks like i made that up thought i brought it up here i did not all right let's go get that gasoline let's go get the gasoline i could have bro i could have sworn that i already had gasoline up there unless no because i got this one out of the out of the uh shack i got this out of the shack so there's no way i i'm gonna I'm all right fair enough maybe i'm just going crazy fair enough all right oh man i'm about to burn bro <laughs> oh i'm about to blow up never mind heating it up i'm about to blow this entire place up let it burn all right what was that I did not. That's what I had to do. That's right. I gotta. I gotta make this report. Um. I think the. Let's go. Let's go out here and get the knots. Seventeen. This is the. This is that device with the fancy name. I forgot it already. That uh Dan Ranger Dan said was the thing. The seventeen. So it's forty four point six degrees Fahrenheit. Seventeen uh knots. Did you report for the no? I'm doing that now. Okay. You don't want to disappoint Mitch on your first night. I, I hope Mitch dies in a fire. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, all right. So we got to go figure out what the weather is. Game crash. No big deal. We just got to. Yep. There we go. All right. So we filled this out. All right. Copy, new guy. Uh, right here. I think I'm going to sign off for the day. Okay. Oh god, don't say that to me. You're a grown man. <laughs> Good night, Connor. Talk to you tomorrow. He's a grown man. I, or I'm a grown man. We're both grown men. Don't <laughs> don't do that. Nah, that's okay. That's fine. No harm, no foul. Always close the boards outside before heading to bed. Oh, that's right. I forgot I opened all of this. So in order to cause I feel like a lot of people aren't gonna know what to do there in order to um fill that out in its uh entirety the thermometer is on the wall the uh i forget what i forget the device already but to it's the thing with the little scoops on the top <laughs> you go outside and it blows the wind and you get that and in order to get the uh weather all you have to do is just go outside look at the weather if it's clear you go put clear which is this is clear what you're seeing right now is considered clear it's not cloudy it's clear i made that mistake a couple times I was getting very frustrated. I was getting very, very frustrated. <laughs> 3.26 a.m. Unintelligible. Huh? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, we can... Okay, this beat means that we can touch it. There's something... On the other line. Connor? I had to pee. This is the worst time to need to go pee. Oh, God. Do you hear that dramatic music in the background? That means that we don't need to go pee. Why can't we just... It, 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 there's a pot on the stove. Okay, okay. No, that's nasty. All right. My first night being out of my cabin gave me a strange feeling. Being left here alone was somewhat unsettling. Ah, I said that at the, from the beginning. That this would be quite the unsettling experience. Where do I pee? Where do you where do you guys want me to pee? Right here? On the stairs? Ah, okay, off into the, the into the distance. Taste the yellow rain! The golden shower. <laughs> the fountain of youth. 
All right, let's get back. Man, I have no shame. What if, what if Connor's over there just like peeking in with his binoculars? Like, yeah, yeah, go ahead and let that thing out. <laughs> oh, Connor, you're such a whore, dude. Whoa. So that was someone standing there. I thought it was, but I, I, I thought maybe I was just seeing things. I thought maybe it was a tree. That was someone standing there. Look at him. He's bald. Hey. Bald men are the scariest. One day I'm going to be bald. Hey, you know what? I better look half as scary. I can sit out on my front lawn and do bald man things. All right, let's go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. I'm so glad I don't have to wear a mask anymore. Night two. Everybody in the house is healthy. It's just you and the wind and the time just melts away. Ah, nice cup of hot cocoa because we don't drink coffee out here. We go ahead and take a, another sip. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Buttercup heaven. Buttercup, buttercup, buttercup. <laughs> I'll take a photo. I'm feeling really happy. Get this nice picture. Oh, yeah, that's nice. I get the picture of the tower, both towers and a little bit of the lake. I take a sip of that nice hot cup of cocoa with the extra marshmallows. Yeah. Oh, we're taking another photo. Let's take a photo of the lake this time. Oh, yeah, that's going to be beautiful. Yeah, I'm going to send that to my lover. Like, this lake reminds me of you. Deep and wet. <laughs> <laughs> no. You copy? Yeah, I copy. I got Connor from Tower 12. You copy? All right, let's go over here and uh, talk to Connor before he dies of boredom. My sleeve is riding up. Hang on a second. <laughs> My sleeve is riding up. Okay, okay, okay. Tower 11. Do you copy? I've been at Connor, what's up? Oh, okay. Excuse me. Let's have a look. Uh, I don't see it. Lost that. Uh, get binoculars. Um, the snow was white, indic indicative of, of a campfire. Wait a second. Wait a second. Did I see the? Did I see the smoke? Oh, it's right there. Okay. Yeah, I see it. To be in the lazy trail sector, which is not a registered campsite. People right. like that don't bother to clean up after themselves. Fire risks are high this season. Mind checking it out? Yeah, why not? Stay safe out there. Yeah, I'll try. To carry your bear spray if you want to do, guy. Over and out. Over and out. All right, um, let's put these away. Let's get the bear spray. We saw that earlier, the mace spray. Or I saw that because I had to restart everything. <laughs> One thing I did notice that if you run sideways, you run faster. So like if you like switch from left to right like this, you run a lot faster than if you were just like going straight. All right, let's go figure out what this smoke was. Eight thirty-seven. 37 Jesus, it took me that long to get over here? I followed the trail that led me to the smoke. Ah! Oh! Oh! He got chomped by one of them bears. Don't worry. I'm on the way with my can of... You're probably dead. You're probably dead. He's dead. Kayla! 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 Calm down. Hey. Oh, Jesus. I'm still sending... I'm sending things. Oh, I sent her pictures of the lake. Okay, what are you talking about? Are you okay? Hope everything is okay. Reply back when you see this. I'm sorry, Kay. I don't think my sector has very good service. Okay. Uh... Is that whistling? 
What is that an EMF in a spirit box? Wait a second. Okay, this guy was out here trying to contact demons. Hello? Oh! I saw him. Who's there? Anybody there? Show yourself. Yeah. I like show yourself. It makes me sound like I'm dominating. Like I'm the dominant one. I'm not though. Okay. Oh. I scared myself. I scared myself. I accidentally sprayed. <laughs> Alright, let's just go. I don't need to be down here, bro. I don't need to be down here. This is not for me. I knew I needed to put out campfire before heading back to the tower. Of course. Of course I need to put out the campfire. If I don't, then I'm gonna get then I'm gonna get uh fished out at by by Connor. I had to put it out. Do we do spray it with a mace? I don't see anything. Oh, here's a, a war. That's not okay. Can't pick that up. I mean, it is, it could be used, but we just can't pick it up. Can I pick up the lake water? I can step in the lake. Oh, I can't go. All, I can't go all the way in the lake water. All right, there's got to be something to put out this fire. Uh, nothing. Nothing. Tower 11, of course. I don't see anything. Maybe I'll look at the fire. Oh, there's a bucket here. My hands are full. Drop this. Now, I had to get water to put it out. Uh, things aren't ever that easy. Some things do take multiple steps. This is one of those things. All right, let's put that fire out. Pick back, let's throw that. Pick back up our. Let's just go. Let's just go. I don't like this. I don't like this. I'm sure nothing will go wrong on the way back. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, thank God. 9.07 PM. Didn't I go out there at like 8.32? As I hiked back to my tower through the dark, I couldn't shake the sense that something was terribly wrong. My mind couldn't help but think what might have happened? What might have happened if what? Am I? Oh. Let's just go back. Which which way is back? Oh, this is the fork in the road, so it's over here. See that? See how fast we are? It's like a it's like the strafe tech. If listen. Ever wonder why crabs, some crabs can run so fast, like how they get all fast when they do that little strafe thing. This is why. Don't get crabs. Don't get crabs. Close this, close this, close this, close this, close this, close that. Boom, boom. Cause he's already stated that he doesn't like leaving these open whenever he goes to sleep. I had to report to Connor about the vacant campsite. All right. All right, Connor. I wonder what you have to say. Hey, Connor, do you? I was just cooking myself some hot. Well, first, what's your status? Yeah, let's talk about me first. What? What? Son of a bitch. What? They never learn, do they? What? What do you mean? What are you talking about? I'm sick of these bastards. It's unbelievable. Has this been happening a lot? The third time this month alone. Anything else you notice in those woods? Uh, scream. scream. Yeah. Must have been one of those red foxes. They sound pretty much like a screaming lady at night. There's no way. It was a manly scream. I don't know what you're talking about, new guy. But I heard from the rangers that a lot of campers have been flocking to that area lately because of the disappearance of those three kids. Kids went missing in that place? They were hiking with their families. They went off the trail and just vanished. No trace of them since. What does that have to do with the campers? Well, people have started spreading rumors that the area might be haunted by some entities. Okay. It's crazy, I know. You would think these rumors would scare people off, but apparently it's been the opposite. Sometimes, I only wish they were true. What do you mean by that? Well, at least now you know why Mitch had to staff Tower 11 urgently. 
Okay, that's unsettling. I hope you don't believe those rumors. Do you? No. I'm not gonna say absolutely not. I'm just saying no. I'm not absolutely sure. Thanks for staying vigilant. I gotta contact the authorities so they can take care of this commotion first thing in the morning. We can't tolerate these goons anymore. If they find them, I'll personally make sure they never set foot in this forest again. Um, keep me updated. Over and out. I am running on, on 18 hours right now, y'all. 18 hours. I feel just like this guy feels. Sleepless. Alright, um... Hey, look. A recipe. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, that didn't send. Oh, yeah, that's right, because I don't have... I don't have signal. Nom nom hee hee. Shut up, Kayla. Shut up, Kayla. You don't know my life. The jelly of that view. By the way, look what I got at home. To. Oh, well, look what I came home to. Oh, that's a lasagna. I don't know. They left me. They left me a recipe though. So there's there's that. Oh, we can. Oh, ho, ho. I remember this. All right. Can I sleep? I was too hungry to go to bed without food. Oh, I gotta eat first. All right, let's chef it up then. Let's chef it up. Let's make us some food. We got what? We got pizza rolls. Nuggets. Oh, you know what? That's what this is for. All right, this is this. That's what this is for. This is for the uh, the pasta. So we gotta get the uncooked pasta and zaddy. Do we put it in this? No, of course not. No, what? It was in a pan. Here it is. Baking. Okay. There we go. Um. There we go. Marinara. I picked that up earlier. I know it was marinara. What else we got? What else? With pepperoni. And then we got cheese. And okay. So let's uh. Pepperoni is right here. Here we go. Pepperoni. Ooh. Let's see. Mozzarella cheese. There we go. Ooh. And diced tomatoes. That's, that's Coca-Cola. That's not diced tomatoes. Ah, here we go. Diced tomatoes. All right. And put it in the... Oh, can I close that? No. Let's put this in the oven. Boom. Close this. Pick up that Coke off the floor. Or, you know, it, it could be just generic cola. Probably not Coke. Oh, well, now it's fizzy. It's fizzy. <laughs> you guys, you there? You guys, you copy? Yeah, I, I copy. What are you, what are you, what, what are you, what you want? What is it? Oh! Just reported their ass to the authorities. Hope they can track them down and get them peace of their mind. I thought he was calling me doing something else. You stay vigilant for such smoke moving forward. That's the or, yeah, let's not do that. Your name here. Did you report for the night yet? I was just getting to it. You better get to it. Bitch didn't sound to be in a very good mood today. You got it. So you what? I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. Alright, well you go hit the sack. Now it's been a tough day, but you're doing an excellent job up there. That could mean one of two things. Thank you, Connor. Um, oh, right now. All right, uh, okay, he wants me to go ahead and do the, uh, the stuff. He wants me to do the stuff, but first. What? I guess I could do that before, uh, before I start eating. When is it gonna finish, though? I kept checking the oven, but it was still cooking. Okay, so it's probably gonna be a little minute. All right, so let's, uh, first do this. This is the temperature. 46.5 degrees Fahrenheit. And this is what I was talking about earlier. 46.5. They so get the thermometers on the wall. Then you get this device right here. What was it? Was it an anometer? Anometer? I forgot. But it shows you how fast the wind's blowing in knots, which is 19 knots. What was that? Or that? 19 knots and let's do clear i'm not sure what it is i'm just gonna go with clear it could be windy jack is our name by the way that's the character's name i wasn't sure if i had put in the right weather condition okay let's keep trying it there we go it's cloudy that's cloudy so if you don't get it right away you just gotta keep going until you do get it i mean obviously if there's a blizzard outside you're gonna know there's a there's a blizzard right 
Ah, it's done. Ooh, it's eating time. Oh, I thought I burnt it. It looked black at the top at first. Thought I burnt it. I did not. Okay, let's um turn the lights off. I want to eat in the dark. <laughs> I want to eat in the darkness. All right. Um, how do I eat? All right, there we go. Is he gonna eat the whole thing like the other guy ate the whole thing? <laughs> This is a big, this is a, man, this is a big dish. This is a big dish. There's no way he eats it all. You, you eating half top. That looks, I'm not gonna lie, bro. That looks so nasty. It looks soggy. Just, but he tearing it up. I was already full. Okay, get back up then. Let's put the, put the rest in the refrigerator, I suppose. Can we put it on the counter? No, all right, yeah, they want it in the refrigerator. Here we go. Let's go to sleep. <laughs> you can never be too. It was getting cold. Thought I'd get wood stove lit. Aww. All right, so we gotta go back outside get wood. Where's where's my flashlight? Turn this on. Where did I drop my flashlight? Cause we gotta go back downstairs. We gotta get the wood. Where's my flashlight? I forgot what the flashlight looks like. Is it black? No, oh, here it is. It's yellow. All right. Close this. Or leave it open. Nope. No, nah, let's, let's close it. I don't see that one guy down there. Let's get wood. Let's get the wood. Should be in there. Whistling again. Okay, let's just get the wood in. Oh, he's walking. He's walking. He's walking. He's walking. I heard him walk. I heard him walk. I heard him walk. Okay. All right, now we're good. We're good. Oh, okay, go, go, go. It's just, it, man. Was that snow? Nah, that wasn't snow. I'm seeing things. Put the wood in. Uh, not, not matches. Gasoline first. Throw that up. Okay. I guess throw it at the wall. That, that works too. Oh my God, I'm about to burn the place down. This whole place is wood. I just cannot control any type of fluid. I am the worst. To the side. All right, now let's go to sleep. Oh, I feel much better. <laughs> I feel much better. I can go to sleep. 2.27 a.m. I was woken by some feeling that caused my eyes to drift open. He's standing there. He's just standing there. I can see his shadow. What does he want me to do? Okay, maybe I can crawl behind him. There was something very strange about that night. Can I hide under the bed? I can't, I can't. Right mouse button. Why is my mic going crazy? Yo, yo, yo. Why is my mic going crazy? Actually, I, I, I think he might've walked away. No, I can. Yeah, I think he walked away. Yeah, no, he's gone. Okay. All right. Turn this on. Now, open this. Oh. Now, what is it? What do we? What do we have here? I didn't know what to make of it at that moment. The only logical thing I could think of was to contact Connor. What do, do I think Connor's like my my savior? If the killer is already here, Connor can't do a thing. But say, hey, I'll, I'll, I'll get the authorities. Nah, Connor's an okay guy. He's not. He's not bad. <laughs> Connor, do you copy? Do you copy? No, I need to talk to you. It's urgent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
There's something outside my door. Mission skull. I don't think these are kids messing around. You know what? 90% of murders would be avoided if y'all would just believe the person at first. This is serious. Oh, no, no. This feels like... Yeah. Like something real. What's that? That's, that makes it more plausible. Right or wrong, if, if you're in the middle of nowhere, doesn't it make it more plausible? Let's just exit with triple dots. Exit with triple dots. It, I think it, it is more plausible that if you're in an area... Connor didn't make any sense. Yeah, he doesn't make sense. We're in an open area where no one's around. Of course they're going to want to kill us. There's not much else I could have done in the dark. All right. Go to sleep. Night three. Okay. Next day, I woke up not being so sure if last night was real or just a dream. Now, why did that happen? <laughs> you just skipped straight through it all. <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. You know, new game, brand new game is going to be bugs. It's fine. Well, why can't I see? I occupy most of my days either with a simple maintenance in and around the tower. Or by scanning the densities of trees all around me. Wait. Wait. Is my lens dirty? My paranoia for these woods only grew after last night, which led me to be extra vigilant moving forward. Was my lens dirty? Hold up. Okay, let's... Dude, why is my lens dirty? Do this again. Oh, hold the clean. Okay. Ah, there we go. Yeah, no, no, no. That makes sense. Okay. I just didn't see that it said hold the clean. I'm so used to, like, it popping up on the screen and just saying hold to do this, hold to do that. That's the flare. Okay. All right. Well, that's that's something. Hello? Is anyone there? I need help. Please, someone answer. God, no. I'm not doing this. I'm sorry. I'm whatever you want, leave me alone. This is Jack Tower 11. No, I hear you loud and clear. Yeah. Yeah. I'm lost and I'm I'm really starting to freak out. What's going on? I don't even know where to start. I went out to explore the area and lost track of time. I don't know who this is. And I can't remember the trail back to my truck. I think I think I'm lost. I need to be mysterious. Can you describe your clothing? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. Oh, it's clothing, clothing, clothing. What equipments do you have, have with you? I have a flashlight, a compass, a fully charged two-way radio, a flare gun, and, and some of my camping equipment. What is your uh, current location? I'm in the middle of the woods, on this trail surrounded by trees. Everything looks different at night. That's obvious. <laughs> I shooting a few flare gun shots might get someone's attention, but no one's come yet. All it did was light up the trees and make everything look even scarier. I just want to find a way out of here. Um, landmarks. Yeah, do you remember any landmarks? Ah, I think I know where the stream is. Walking east when I came here. Walking east. Thank goodness, I see it. No, he went right at the fork. I'm at a trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Oh, you're not coming to me. You're going left. Take the left. Take the left trail. <laughs> right. Yeah, I think I should tell him to take the left trail. I, I, I knew it. I thought it looked familiar. I just don't know I who this guy is, all right? With this decision. Thanks for helping me through this. I'm right here. What? I what do you mean? You. I hear your whistles. Oh, God, no. That's not me. It's not me. Oh no. Hide, hide. I fixed my mic, by the way. So now it doesn't make a sound. 
I didn't really fix it, it's just stuck. <laughs> Oh, well. well, if I'm forced to answer, can I see? Wait, that don't look like the guy. Wait a second. No, wait. Should I answer it? That doesn't look like the guy. That doesn't look like the killer, though. Let's just answer it. Let's, let's, let's just answer it. Ah, I thought so. Holy moly, what took you so long in there? I've been knocking for hours. I was asked to check in on you. What were you up to, pal? Adult things. I was assisting a lost hiker. Yeah. Or, or, nah. Nothing much. Let's do nothing much. Anyways, you got your tower supplies here just to... Ooh, here you go. I feel like I'm going to pass out if I keep holding this for one more second. Can I tell him about the thing? What were you doing there last night? What do you mean? Up north, why were you there? How do you know? I wouldn't screw around out there, pal. I was required to investigate on a campfire smoke. Oh, Lord have mercy. Nasty business up there, pal. Bobcats and bears. You be careful out there, pal. These woods aren't normal, and there's stuff out there that would love to get a piece of you. Not to mention, you'd be quite a distance from help if anything happened. I've got enough to keep me preoccupied here. Absolutely, it's a busy job. I've been hearing you've been in a bit of the edge, or you've been on edge. Everything all right? Just getting used to the new environment. Yep, let's do that. Let's not tell him about the skull yet. Unless, that's the spirit. Yep. Did you notice anything unusual on your hike up north yesterday? Oh, he. Oh, I'm being forced to tell him about the skull. He might be a good guy. Thought he was an ominous creep. Oh, Lord have mercy. Did you take a photo of it before cleaning it up? I didn't think about it. I didn't think about it. No? Not because I didn't think about it. You know, it's best we don't dwell on these things, pal. Besides, we can't do anything without the evidence. He's got a point. Anyways, it's getting late. I better get out now. Just keep watch. Thanks for the supplies. You know, let me follow you to make sure you actually leave. Don't want you like climbing the edge and then trying to hide. Yeah, yeah, you go down those stairs. Yeah, left, right, left, right. He disappeared. Okay. Will I see him walking out there? Of course not. All right. Well, thanks for the supplies. I'll go ahead and uh, put this on my bookshelf. That would probably be the best place to, okay. Nope, try that again. Here we go. Wait, could I open it? Could I open that? No, it didn't give me an option to open it. Come on. Come on, you did it so perfectly last time. Aim it up there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now what? I got a, I got a hiker killed, that happened. Let's go ahead and let's enter all this in. So 57.4 is the, uh, the Fahrenheit degrees. Let's go out and get the wind speed. With the, the one meter <laughs> that does the knots. 24. This is getting higher and higher, isn't it? The wind's getting heavier. Someone's doing a ritual. Someone is doing a seance. All right, let's put the 24 as a knots. Um, zero, because I got that man killed. <laughs> I'm not I'm not gonna tell them about that. Missed? Clear? Not clear? Rain? No? Dust storm? He waves? Alright, let's just go back through the list. Blizzard? Is it a blizzard out there? No? Thunderstorm? Uh Let's, let's, let's go back there for the top. Did I miss something? Ah, wind, 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 windy. Of course, of course. I don't know why I didn't see that or why I didn't even think of that to begin with. Windy. I probably cut that out of the video. If I did cut that out of the video, it's because I tried multiple options and didn't think about putting wind first. It looks pretty normal. That guy over there is still awake or Connor's over there is still awake. So that tells me that 
at the very least it's not close to 12 o'clock yet because around 12 o'clock they put the lights out that was in the rules my nose itches don't get nose piercing i was too hungry to go to bed without food do i have to cook again no 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 i don't have to cook again but first let me make sure okay all right yeah so they're gonna make me eat first i wanted to i wanted to be uh productive and go ahead and get the firewood for this because i'm probably gonna need it but it is what it is all right ingredients actually no no i don't need the ingredients right because i i put it in the refrigerator i didn't eat the other half but i will put this in the microwave now yeah yeah go ahead and heat that food up go ahead and heat that food up ain't nothing ain't no, there's nothing wrong with heating food up i want y'all to know that bro if you are in college or anything like that heat your food up man you don't you ain't gotta try to stunt in front of everybody hey let's go out to dinner let's do the nah bro save your money heat your food up save save your food never throw it away bro just heat it up especially if you like the food unless it's fries from mcdonald's don't heat that back up and i love mcdonald's i do like us <laughs> Boy, I tell you, I love McDonald's, but don't, don't heat their fries back up. It, <laughs> I don't, I don't think I've, I've seen a place yet where you can heat the fries back up and it's still good. All right. Um, can I go to sleep? It was getting cold. Ah, yeah, of course, of course. I gotta get the wood. I gotta get the wood. Can't forget the wood. <laughs> I should have just been. I should have just got multiple stacks of wood, put it over here on the side, and I would have been fine. I didn't do that though. Let's go get some wood. Whoa! What's going on with that tree? Oh, it's just the wind. <laughs> that, that tree was going all over the place. It's over there, basically dancing. Oh, that's me. That's my footsteps. Oh my god! What the freak, man? Yo! You just gave me a heart attack. What is wrong with you? I understand loneliness can make the mind play tricks on you. Who are you? I need to be alarmed. I'm a worker. I was just doing some routine maintenance on the radio tower over there. Thought I'd say hi, the new guy everyone's been talking about. Nice to meet. Do you usually work this late? What? Every Sunday, just trying to keep the communication lines open. We must ensure that the right message reached the right places, wouldn't you agree? Right, we will rely on information. Nah. No, 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 I agree, fire risk. Yeah, 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 fire risk. Absolutely, but some fires are meant to burn and no amount of prevention can stop them. What do you mean by that? Nature has its own plans. Some things can't be controlled, no matter how hard we try. And sometimes disasters are just another form of cleansing, a way for the land to purify itself. I, I, I see you around, Salas, Salas, Salas. Have a good night, Jack. Hope you sleep well. But remember, curiosity can lead to places you'd rather not go. Farewell, Jack. I didn't tell you my name. The guy gave out the creepiest vibes. Yeah, because I didn't tell him my name. And why would they tell him my name? They don't. They, they don't even call me by my name. And who is they? I, wait, wait, whoa, whoa! He said everyone's been talking. There's only one other person, and it's Connor. Who's everyone? Nah, he's the killer, bro. He's the killer. Is this snowing? Am I tripping? It's snowing, right? Or are those ghost orbs? Ghost orbs. Ghost orbs. Put it in a journal. Put this up here. No, let's not put that there. Then I'm really gonna blow up the place. I'm in here, bro. Chill out, Connor. You guy. You there? 
Hey, Connor. I'm chilling. You should have seen what happened earlier, though, Connor. Right here. Finally. I've been trying to reach you for a while now. Where have you been? Uh, ran into Salaz. The guy maintaining that nearby radio tower. Is this about yesterday? What? What do you mean? Radio tower's been out of service for ages now. What do you mean? It was closed down years ago after a lightning strike fried its systems. Its repair cost was deemed too costly. Its repair date was postponed until the next big funding. You yeah, almost had me. No time soon, according to Mitch. You had me in the first half. Look, if what you're saying is true, it could be another one of those goons playing pranks on you. He knew my name. name. You think he's been listening? Possibly. Who cares about the park guidelines, Connor? Next time you see him, get his information or take a photo. We need to figure this out. I'm giving him these hands, bro. I'm sorry, Connor. Anyways, I'm seeing that you've already reported. I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. Please stop hitting the sack every night and then telling me about it. Over and out. That's like me telling you when I need to take a dookie every time. Hey, Connor. Hey. Huh. About to flood that toilet. It's like, hey, I'm gonna go hit the sack. But you hit that sack, Connor. You hit that sack and you hit it hard. My unease was starting to grow with each passing day. So when I signed off that night, I told myself that it was just a change of environment that I needed getting used to. The strangeness I've seen so far in those woods was not enough to cause an alarm yet. However, that would soon change. Could it not? Two nights later. Okay, here we go. 9.18 p.m. Oh, it's finally raining. You got, it. you got a minute? I'm listening. Well, good news. Just heard from the HQ. They say we've got a new system update on the computer. Oh? They wanted me to let you know. They say it's an important security update. No more snoopers, I guess. I do I no, I can just exit. I know how to update the computer. Thanks for letting me know. Alright, I just gotta go here. And then I gotta type in Did I spell it wrong? No no no, okay. I messed that up, yeah. It's U D U yeah, there we go. U P D. Okay. Um No no no. Uh Package code is down there. I see it. All right. So, uh, what was it? It's, it's update. It's capital update. Uh, package code, right? Maybe it's just update. Let's do help. Ah, it is just update. So it's it's update. Boom. He's into the update package code. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Package found! Looking for serviceable lines. Um, please enter an active line. Busy lines are those three down there. Serviceable lines are up there. Let's do five... Five, four, eight, seven? Five, four, eight, seven. System is now up to date. What happened? Hello? Did the power go out? Did he cut the lines? Did he? He cut the lines. He cut the lines. Oh no, 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 no. Connor still has power. What time is it? Oh, it's only eight, like 17. So it's still, power was out. Okay, okay. Oh, what if I'm doing signal down? The power's out. I can't do anything. I, do I need to go out in the in the rain? No, right? No way. I'm not going out there, bro. It's storming. It's a storm out there. It's raining really hard out there. I may have a bald scalp. I don't want people laughing at me from the rain, making noises against my bald scalp. Yeah, I do. It's kind of funny. I ain't gonna lie. 
Do I have anything in here? No. Uh, in here? No. When they say power, is, the power is out. I do not want to hide. I don't know why I chose that. Oh, look, it's working a little bit. Oh, there we go. There we go. My mic is kind of working a little bit. I don't know. It's, it's being really weird. Anyways. All right, let's, um, I guess we just got to go, go down there. I don't know. We just got to go in the rain. Power's out though. Oh, you know what? The generator may just be off. I think the generator's just off. Yep. Generator's off. Look at that. I need gas. And the good thing is, I don't think I have to go to the shack to get that gas. I don't want to die. No, I want to go back upstairs because I do have a gas can upstairs that I specifically save for a reason like this. Yep, there it is. Oh, let's go fill, the, fill it up with gas. There we go, now we got power. All right, let's go back upstairs. I can't go back upstairs. I really had to pee before going back up. Of course I do, why do I always have to pee? Oh, I can't go in here. You know, <laughs> there's a mic meter. There's a mic meter. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at this. <laughs> okay, all right. All right, so now we know that this is a place to hide. Apparently. Go ahead and pee. What's even more interesting is that my mic works sometimes and sometimes it doesn't. I don't know what's up with that. All right, let's um, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I don't see anybody. All right, we're going upstairs. <laughs> I feel safe again. I feel safe again. Is Connor still awake? Oh, I don't get to see. We don't get to see if Connor's still awake. One week later. A whole week later, time was flying by. Connor's generator was under maintenance, which meant I had to cover his area for the past two days. When there were no fires going, the only thing I'd do is check in on Connor twice a day. That might have been the only time I ever talked. Unless I was talking to myself. 2.34 a.m. We got another one. Oh. I know it's late, but you're going to want to see this one, Jack. Honor. Jack. Yes. Jack. I'm half asleep. I wake up. Okay. You copy? Okay, yeah, I copy. I copy. I'm getting up. I'm getting up. God, you don't let a man rest. You didn't believe me when I told you all the mother times. You copy. Right here, Connor. Okay, tell you what. I don't have the energy to do this right now. What happened? I've been here busting my ass, working on that old piece of garbage generator. And now I'm seeing this. I'm seeing more smoke to my west. Looks like we got another camper. Freaking campers, they never learn. You see the campsite from your end? Don't worry, Connor. I got this. My father bought me a gun yesterday. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Of course you are. If they don't run away this time, take your photos and IDs. All right. And if things get worse, don't hesitate to call HQ for help. I won't have to do that. Update me tomorrow morning. I'm gonna get some rest. I have a good night's sleep, Connor. I hate your guts, but have a good night's sleep. I'll do you this solid one time. You only get one. Oh, y'all going? Okay, I'm on my way. Let me go. Let me grab my 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 gag real quick. Where's my? Oh, that's. When I say get, I'm not meaning gun. I just mean my flashlight and mace spray. <laughs> they don't give me a gun out here. Oh, didn't feel safe going downstairs. Oh, you know what? Maybe they won't want me to look at it instead. Maybe they just want me to get the binoculars. The binoculars. Just get those. Hmm. Get that down. Get this. And bro, if y'all still over there, by the time I get over there, somebody getting a spanking. Somebody. Oh. I didn't know what to make of it. They're having a ritual. 
Only thing that made sense at the time was to take evidence of it. Do I have a camera? Oh, my phone. Yeah, my phone. Face to take photo. Okay. Oh, we got y'all now. I got y'all now. Zoom in. Oh, I looked over. How did y'all get there so fast? Oh, he's fast. He's fast. Hide under bed. God, this is the perfect time for my mic to break. Perfect. <laughs> perfect. I can talk. Okay. I can still hear him breathing. I can still hear him breathing. So I'm not sure if I should come out now or. He's like over that way. All right. We just got to remember what we, what we learned. If we run sideways, we go faster. Uh oh, 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 uh oh. I made a mistake, I made a mistake, I made a mistake. Go, 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 goes to the this shed over there once he gets to that shed we sprint past him so we'll give it another few seconds be patient chat be patient now we go we go we go we go we go we go he doesn't know he doesn't know he doesn't know he's too slow he's too slow go 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 Security guard? Uh, maybe we should. No. Forget him. Ooh. <laughs> oh, security guard, I'm sorry. You dead. I'm leaving. We out, we out, we out, we out. I'll see you later, sucker. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Almost got cucked by my own door. As adrenaline kicked in, I hit the gas and drove to the nearest ranger cabin. Out of breath, I radioed in to alert HQ. Look, Jack, we all get a little star crazy out there, Mitch answered. Next morning, authorities allegedly ran a small investigation of the area, but of course, they met with no signs of misconduct. No one ever be believed my story, dismissing it as a product of isolation. Just stick to looking out for fires, Mitch offered. 
However, that was the last time I ever set my foot in those woods. Well, Connor did try to warn us. The unease still sits heavy in my stomach. Even though many years have passed, the experience still feels vivid in my memory. My family thought I was making the whole thing up, which is really out of my character. But I know what I saw. Real or not, after dark, these woods can become a haven for illegal activities. So if any of you plan on going camping soon, please be safe. That's a good positive message to end off on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good job. Good job. Good game. Really good game. I think, um... It, it, it could've, could've definitely been longer. Could've definitely been longer. Uh, I thought it was good overall and anyways. Ah, it was Jacksepticeye, so he was there. Oh, Connor VA voiced somebody. Okay, okay. All right, um... In my opinion, yeah, yep. I think it, I could have. I think it could have definitely been longer. I liked the story. I think it could have been a more fleshed out story though. But Rayo killed this, bro. He killed this. Like, cause y'all gotta understand, this is all based on other people's stories that come into Rayo. You know what I'm saying? So this is this is. I, I liked it. I liked it. Um, I, I still don't know which one I like the best, but I do think this is, in my opinion, I think it's up there, bro. I think it's definitely up there. Uh, uh, eight out of ten. 8 out of 10 on the story. 8 out of 10 on the story. Not Rayo's fault. I think the game itself was really good. Story was uh. Other than that, bro, I had a good time. I hope you had a good time. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new. Other than that, peace.